Good morning, it is Saturday and we are vlogging. Um, right now, the kids are playing Disney Infinity with Lee and I thought, since I had the thumb issue, where my whole thumb nail snapped, and it's actually snapped further down than my nail ends, so I've got to wait for it to grow out before I can even start growing them. I'm gonna just chop these all down. I did file them down quite a lot at the time, but I'm gonna chop them all down because they just look crazy now. And oh, I'm so out of breath because I ran up the stairs. Still super unfit, in case you're wondering. Um, so I'm gonna go and do that, paint my nails, and then I think I'm gonna go to the lake. Got nail polish removed on the table. Not great, it's a white painted table. So we'll come into the kitchen. Also, my hands are absolutely wrecked from having really dark nail polish on. How, how do people wear dark nail polish and just not get it everywhere when they take it off their hands? This is the patch where I got nail polish on the table. It keeps coming in and out of focus. It is here. Um, so it's not that terrible. I ended up kind of buffing it out with nail polish remover, but ugh. So frustrating. The colour that I put on my nails is Designated DJ from SE. I'm quite liking it. Um, I'm not totally missing the the short, well, the short, not totally missing the long nails yet. Um, it's actually kind of freeing to have short nails because I was living in fear of breaking them all the time. Uh, but I really like this colour and I do kind of think that dark colours like this look better on short nails. So that's what I'm going to be telling myself now I've cut them. Now we're off to KFC, I think. We're going to go to the lake. We're gonna go to the lake and try and teach Milo how to ride his bike without stabilizers because we feel like terrible parents that he can't do that already at almost six. Um, but while the weather's still nice, we thought we'd get on it. Uh, but it's lunchtime now because the kids took forever to get dressed. And uh, so KFC is calling first. We've come to Costa instead because the queues at McDonald's and KFC were insane. And Milo's cold, so he's like wrapped up in my blanket scarf. <laughs> Trying to drink <laughs> a very cold milkshake, of course. Yeah. Lee and the kids have gone to Greg's because they didn't really want a lot from Costa, apparently. Um, and I am going to go around the corner to the beauty outlet. Haven't been in ages. Always my favourite section. Look at this. So funky. I'm so into glitter at the moment. Look at this one. Hot tub, apparently. Oak tub, hot tub, you know, like oak couture, hot couture, I don't know. I have had a lot of requests over the years for W7 stuff and I've never really gotten into it. Would you guys like a review of some stuff from this brand or anything specific? I am thinking about doing some colored tips again though. I think I got this one last time I was in here. I've still got some. I may do a little bit of something in the ends today. Interesting, I didn't know they had wet and wild in here. Those are amazing, these little, palettes and this stuff too. That is like an amazing discount. did not go well. Any tips that you can give me, please? All ears. So this is a look right now. I have spent um, most of the afternoon so far trying to declutter and put away a ton of makeup from various different places in the house. I'm not totally finished, but the plan was that I was going to put it all away and organize it. And then tomorrow, I'm gonna bring it out section by section, test some stuff out, and I'm gonna film some um, kind of makeup graveyard, declutter, whatever you want to call it kind of videos. Um, and that is what I'm going to do. I also put a load of stuff to one side that I've purchased over the past month or so for a haul. I'm trying to get it together. Uh, but I just wanted to show you a couple of the things that were stand out. I've got different things on each side of my face, 
each eye, all kinds of stuff going on right now because I thought whilst I was doing this, I was picking things out like, do I like this? Do I not like this? Some stuff I've never even tried. Um, and so yeah, I'll just show you a couple of highlights that I've come up with because it's going to be forever till I've finished this series. This is my little tin of new stuff to talk about. And these are just a few things that I haven't actually tried until right this very minute and I'm quite impressed with. This ultra strobe stick from Revolution, not normally into um, liquid or cream highlighters, but I really, really like this one. Uh, these two liquid liners, very, very different, but I like both of them. One is the, what is this called? Epic Ink Liner from NYX. That's more like a brush. I like the way that applies. But also this one, which is a duo liner from um, B. I'll just show you what it looks like. This is the end that I'm interested in, the very, very fine felt tip. They are both felt tip ends, but this one's really, really fine and flexible. Really easy to use. And this, Matte Melted Too Faced. Oh, Too Faced Matte Melted. The colour, what is this colour? Um, it's happening. I bought this like this time last year. I don't know whether I've ever used it. I bought three liquid lips when I was in Sephora in Paris. Um, and I think they were pretty much all the same colour. And this was one of them. And this is the first time I'm actually wearing it. I've been wearing it for a couple of hours and I'm really impressed with it. I've been intentionally licking my lips, like pressing my lips together and there's no sign of wear so far. I can't really leave it on any longer because I need to take my makeup off and I mean, I've got so much glitter on my eyes, I can't stand it. Need to take my makeup off and uh, do a face mask. So I, this is not a proper test, but first impressions are very, very favourable. I found this Evolve Organic Beauty is what it's called and the mask is Radiant Glow. So I'm going to give that a go right now. Um, and in a little while, after we've had dinner and all that stuff, I'm going to use the things that Lee bought me. Right now I have on a heat patch. He's been to the shops to get some tea and stuff and brought me back some things, bless him. I am in agony and he obviously realises that, so we've got me some stuff. Painkillers are just, it's, there's nothing at the moment. Um, I have the strongest painkillers and they are not touching it. Very, very frustrating. Maybe it's all in my mind. So he's got me this, which I'm gonna give a go. I haven't tried this in a really long time. Maybe it'll do something. And then this, they are my evening plants. I swear I've got a blackhead coming down here. That never happens, I never get that. This lipstick really does wanna stick with me. So I'm gonna give this a go, this mask. It doesn't look particularly nice, but I'm going to try it. convinced that mask really did anything it felt really soft afterwards but it had exfoliaty particles so I never really totally trust that the mask itself has done something when you remove it and it kind of scrubs your face manually anyway uh, but it felt nice you know looked gross smelled like chocolate whatevs um so it is the morning after it's Sunday and Lee has convinced me to finally go back to the gym after months and months <sighs> really can't be bothered um but I figure I'm just gonna go and sit on the bike and watch Netflix for like 45 minutes. You can't go out in there because it's wet, look. I can't see the thunder. Well, you can't, it's just a noise. Thunder. Okay, so I have come home and I've decided that I'm going to start my declutter video. And I was watching, hang on. Why am I talking to you and facing something else? Um, I was watching while I was in the gym some other declutter videos and I just thought I would check some out for inspiration, both on format, how they filmed them and how long they would be and stuff. Um, and the one that I liked the best format wise was one from Viviana Does Makeup. I think she is she Viviana Edit now everywhere, I think so. Um, anyway, her format was my favourite, so I'm basically copying it completely. But I don't think I'm going to be able to do it in one video purely because of the lipstick. I think I'm going to do everything else in one video and the lipstick in one because the lipstick is insane. I'm pretty good with everything else, but I struggle with lipstick. I find it really difficult. Now, this is kind of all lipstick-ish and then there's more, 
because there's lip liners, there's other brands. It's just, I don't even, I can't. It's really hard. So this is gonna have to be a separate video. Also, what are you eating? A broccoli stalk. Is this the noise you're gonna make throughout the entire video? Lee has just gone to start his ironing upstairs and Milo's taking his iPad, so I've got 20 minutes maybe um, to do this downstairs, which is the lightest area. Plus I'm using this, so I'm gonna kind of use my, I'm gonna put the camera facing down onto here. Um, and so yeah, I'll probably better get on with it. I totally just put makeup on, especially to do the intro and outro to that video. So I ended up doing liquid lipstick, lip gloss stains and all that stuff in this video. Um, and I wasn't even gonna be able to touch lipsticks. It was insane absolutely insane i don't know why i'm filming this because i was just gonna get some deodorant out of the drawer i'm feeling really gross um so lee's just gonna have to get kfc i have got to put all this stuff on the computer and edit a little bit and then this week's gonna be absolutely manic so i'm hoping to get as much done tonight as i can because i have like three trips to london which is absolutely unheard of and my child mind is off i timed this horribly So I made it into London. I am exhausted already. So by the time I get home tonight at 12, I'm gonna be dying. And tomorrow I'm working as well, so oh, no thanks. Um, I am on my way to an event, which I'm excited about. And then I'm gonna go see Jane for a drink and maybe a bite sweet before my train home later. probably won't um, but I think I'm seven minutes away from where we're supposed to be good morning it's days later um, I've been the worst vlogger this vlog is gonna be like the weirdest mashup of random days but I've come shopping early on Friday morning because I wanted to do a come shopping with me in Primark um, and hopefully I'll manage to get some stuff filmed because they can be a bit weird about that kind of thing in there. Um, the lift doors opened and two identical dressed women. Because I feel like they were doubles of each other. You know, like one of them was a stunt double. That was really weird. Um, so I'm walking down the stairs now. <laughs> um, yeah, I've been really productive the last couple of days so I thought I would get on that roll, keep on that roll and get off to Primark. I also want to have a look at New Look because that's been getting a lot of press recently for really nice kind of slogan jumpers. So we will check that out today. Love these jeans, so my kind of style. High waist and skinny. Also this cardigan looks like the most comfortable cardigan that there ever was. Oh, apparently it's the first day of autumn today and I'm feeling this whole section. Jumpers, jumpers and see lots of slogany stuff. I actually really like this one. This is like super, super soft and cozy. I think it's only 7 99 I like it and I also like that it's got that kind of maroon which is the same colour as the top that I'm wearing today. This is 22 dollars I actually don't like it as much. It's a thicker material so I get it but it's like, I don't know, it's not very flattering on me. Oh my god I love all of this. Confetti balloon, hem party tattoos, love it all. I knew it was someone's birthday soon. It's funny but when I actually go into a store I never really find a lot of clothes in you look that I really like but on ASOS I do. I don't know if it's because I have to see it on a model or what, but there's been some stuff that I bought through ASOS from New Look that's been really nice, but I've never really come away with a load of stuff from that. Uh, right, so I'm off to Primark now to film my video. Wish me luck with the security guards. <laughs> and like, there's a decent amount of autumn winter stuff there. Must avoid boots, must avoid boots. Do not need any more makeup. How nice are these roll necks in Marks and Spencers? The yellow one too. <gasps> have to walk through Marks and Spencers to get to Primark and kind of want one of these jumpers now. Not bad. I feel like they did this last year, but this year I really want it. They have some really, really nice stuff. I know that when you're in there, there's a certain, let's say, demographic 
who was shopping in there at the same time. But that's because no one else will give it a chance. It's really, really nice stuff now. Success. Everything's done. Um, I have a feeling, I mean, I managed to film tons. No one cared. Um, but I have a feeling that all the way through the video, my voice is getting lower and lower, especially in the changing rooms. Um, so we'll see how that works out when I come to edit it and you can't hear what I'm saying. But I'm gonna go home and have a coffee now. Well deserved. Also avoided Costa. I'm trying. I'm trying to spend less money. Um, and so went into Primark, ended up buying one cardigan and a tiny little thing for lipsticks on my windowsill, which you will probably see at some point when I do that video um, where I declutter my lipsticks. I'm hoping to film that today. We'll see if I get around to it. Um, but yeah, home now. I ended up taking so long trying to edit together this jumble that was a vlog um, that I've hardly got any time to film any more videos. I'm hoping to get two done. I've got about two hours till I've got to set off the school run. So I'm gonna finish this, wind it up so I can get this one squared off. Um, and yeah, I've got so much tidying to do and I'm going around to my friend's house tonight. We're gonna do Sing Star. It is our favorite thing to do. And I really need to do all this stuff before the school run. That is it. But I am going to a blogger festival tomorrow with Emma and we're meeting up with my friend, Paul, who was the friend who did my makeup earlier this year. So that should be fun and I will vlog again. Uh, but I have tons of other videos coming as well. I'm getting, I'm really into it right now. Hopefully you're enjoying it all. Uh, but the vlogs aren't going away. The beauty content isn't going away. I'm just kind of like putting out what I want to put out. And hopefully you are liking it. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.